In this quick tip video, I'm gonna share with you a tip that I wish I knew when I was digitizing logos. Now, certainly in the days when I was punching, I mostly got scanned artwork. But today, people take a photo of their logo on their iPhone and they send it through to you. And nine times out of 10, it, it's on an angle, it's rotated, it's not as you need it to be on your software for digitizing. So let me show you how you can very easily and quickly resize and rotate that artwork ready for your digitizing. So let's click over to the software and we will import that artwork. And this is just a photo of my business card that I took, um, which is again, something you would probably get from your customer. And again, it's rotated, it's on an angle, and it's obviously not the right size that I need for that artwork to be, to be digitized. Uh, I could use a, a guide and I could uh, click on the artwork and I can, you know, try keep rotating it till I get it to be as straight as I can be. Uh, and then I can use my, my measure tool and I can say, well, that's not the 55 millimeter I want it to be, that's 96. So I can select it and rescale it down and you can keep doing that till you get what you want. But there's a better tip for you. We'll undo all that, bring that back to the original state, get rid of that guide. And the tool I want you to use is select your artwork and go up to this tool here, which is the transform by reference line numerically tool. Or you can also find it under edit, transform, and transform by reference line numerically. Terrible name, but trust me, you're gonna love this feature. Select that. Then your next step is to draw a reference line on your artwork. What you wanna do is find a place that you can measure in the real world to understand the size that you want it to be and that you can use as an anchor point for the angle of that artwork. So on this logo, the obvious point is from the I to the M. So I click on the I and I click down on the M and up pops a transform by reference line dialog box. Now I know for my logo for my left chest, I want the L to the M part to be about 40 millimeters. That's the kind of size I'm aiming for that to be. So I want to resize that line that I just drew to be 40 millimeters. And it's currently on an angle when I digitize that reference line. Of course, I want it to be exactly straight at a zero degree angle. So I also want to rotate that graphic to be zero degrees and I press okay. And it does that work for you. If we zoom in, we can now bring down a baseline and we can see it's pretty much spot on straight, just as I want it to be for my artwork. And if I press the M on my keyboard and measure from that I to that M, it's spot on to that 40 millimeters. So I've rotated it and I've resized it in one go using the awkwardly named, but pretty good tool, transform by reference line numerically. And that's your welcome tip.